wait, do I feel weird? Okay, what is going on? This lighting is just not happening. Um, hey guys! <laughs> I haven't vlogged in my car in so long. This seems so weird to me. Hey, what's up? I'm Maddie and I just got done with work week It's officially done. So excited for rush week. I'm so pumped um, If you guys don't know what that is, it's basically just like a week where we recruit girls for the next pledge class So like freshmen or sophomores if they want to rush too. It's like a sorority college thing So I got done with that. That's why I'm wearing my pie pie stuff. I have like three or four videos to film tonight and edit so that's cool oh, five because i'm actually making the video that we're posting tonight for pi five so busy day it's 4 30 i have an eyelash appointment today at five just to like touch up stuff for rush and everything so i decided to film a drive with me video and just going to jam out to some music i don't know what it is i feel like filming right now is just so weird and i don't know i'm just I haven't vlogged my car in so long, I feel like. We are going to listen to some amazing music. Do y'all feel the awkwardness of me right now? I don't know what's going on. I'm continuing on. Let's go. Let's jam. I literally found this song like two minutes ago. <laughs> I'm just sitting here editing this video. I don't know why I'm acting that way. I It's been a long, stressful week, and I was very stressed out and didn't really know how to deal with everything that I had to do, so I apologize for being awkward. I was like, I can't jam out to music right now, so I'm just going to talk to you guys, and that's, that's what happened. So basically, I'm just going to talk to you guys, like a little life update, just because I haven't like had a chance to vlog much other than move in and I feel like I just haven't really sat talked so I moved in like a week or two ago I had to move in early because of this whole recruitment rush thing yeah that's basically it um trying to think of things that have like changed but there hasn't been a ton of things that have changed room is officially done basically like 99% 98 99% done so I will be filming a room tour soon not this week maybe tonight I don't know I'm like all over the place right now but an apartment tour will be coming maybe in like a month or so depending on when we actually finish it just because we still have a few rooms to do like one of our rooms it's like a study room but there's a room that doesn't have a door, it's just kind of open, but it's we made it into a study room. Like, I have no idea where I'm going. Um, this road is just taking me right, that's cool. So, it's really cute. We have like this little desk, and then I put my iMac like desktop computer on there. We're going to have a shelving unit that has cute decorations and everything, and then we're gonna have a wall that has a collage of just random wall hangings but I'm really excited for that room it's gonna look really cute we didn't know what else to do with that room another plan like another idea that we have for that room was to make it another bedroom we were gonna put in a couch that's like a pull-out couch like a pull-out bed that wasn't going to fit and whenever you pull it out it's just it wouldn't look cute that was for the purpose of our parents sleeping there but the couch that I got is so big that if Kate's parents come and my parents come at the same time like same weekend for like a game or something me and Kate can just sleep either on the floor in our room or honestly like the couch in the living like both of us could sleep on that couch at the exact same time so we decided to just do it that way and then our parents could sleep in our room like on my bed or something those details haven't been like figured out or anything but that's kind of just how it's going the living room I got so many questions over where I got that couch and the couch is from rooms to go it was one of those things where you can design it on your own so I just picked the couch style and then the fabric that I wanted to use so I just chose like the light gray it's kind of like a suede type of material not exactly suede but okay where the heck am I this is kind of sketchy to be honest we're gonna turn around I feel like the animal metro station is somewhere over here I think it's there you know what no it's not <laughs> Lighting is so much better now! Thriving! 
And I have not had a chance to explain that I'm now a dope creator, which means that there will be giveaways on my dope account. So if you have dope, or if you don't have dope, actually download it. It's a shopping app that you can like order things from different stores at the exact same time, which is so convenient. I actually just had my first giveaway a few days ago. I think it ended today. Like three or four of my favorite things that I really liked. Go follow me on dope. Link is in the description box below. It's near the top. There will be more giveaways coming soon. I just haven't had a chance to really make it as good as I wanted to just because I've been so busy with moving in and rush and it's just been super super crazy. Like I don't think I've ever been this busy in my life. It, it's actually insane. <laughs> These cars are not supposed to be parked here because holy crap holy there's no room for my car. I'm in the other lane. This is this is nice. Ah! Don't pull out please. Okay thank you. <laughs> I'm making no sense. <laughs> And okay, so I'm gonna be completely honest. Whenever I heard how a work week goes, I'm like, I am not looking forward to this at all. Like, this is gonna be so, like, this week is going to be the longest week of my life. I'm not kidding you when I say I actually had fun at work week. Like, it was so fun. I love being able to see all my sisters and like talking to them and working through everything that we have to go through. I got to meet new people in my pledge class because our pledge class is like 140 plus. Just so many people compared to like a normal size recruitment but since Alabama is so big with rush and like Greek life we have over 2,500 PMs. like PNM stands for potential new members so basically like the rushies so we have over 2,500 people PNMs going through rush this year and for my year there's over 2,600 which is insane that is so many girls so if you divide that by 16 sororities I mean there's 18 but only 16 formal rush that's a ton of girls so we have over we have a crap ton of girls and a pledge class obviously you can't meet every single person in your pledge class the first few months that you're at school just because like that's impossible it's been nice getting to meet new people and like talk to all of them and everything and i feel like we've all like grown closer just with staying together for a solid week going on two weeks now for eight ish hours a day week was actually really fun and I enjoyed it and it makes me look forward to rush like actual rush itself and like just getting to talk to all these girls and seeing if they would be a good fit for pie fi and all this stuff like that is so exciting and this whole process like I loved going through rush last last year and I know a lot of girls were like oh my gosh I hated rush like blah 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 no like I love rush I love going to be I love being able to go to all the houses and talk to other girls and figure out where I think I would fit best it was so fun for me the only downside about rushing in Alabama is that it's so hot and you're outside and heels or whatever shoes you might be wearing like outside in the humid heat it's not dry heat it's humid so it's even worse <laughs> so that's just kind of my spiel on rush I hope this kind of helped you a little bit and like making you feel better about rush and also I've, get, I've been getting a lot of questions like oh like Alabama's so racist or um I'm a girl of color like I feel like I'm not gonna fit in rush or people are gonna drop me like no we do not discriminate at all and I'm speaking on behalf of Pi Fi I pretty sure all of houses like all the other houses do the same but I'm not gonna speak for them just because I don't know and I don't know for sure if you are a girl of color or anything you have any disorder anything like we do not discriminate we are not gonna drop you because of that like we rush you for who you are I've been getting tons of questions about that so don't be afraid to rush I really do encourage you guys to rush just because you are meeting so many girls and it's just a way to get involved with the school as well if you're really hesitant about it like I say definitely go through the process but if you think it's not for you after you go through it then you can drop it's not that big of a deal but you can at least say that you gave it like you gave it a shot also, how on earth did I forget to tell you guys that I came out with new merch? This is my back to school limited edition and everything is so cute. Like it turned out adorable. Everything how I expected it to. Um, the link to my merch is down below. But there's so many options to choose from. There's pillows. There's a backpack now. New t-shirts, a new hoodie, mugs too. Definitely a new variety of things. And I'm really excited about it. So go check it out in the description box. I'm so happy about it. That is all that I have today. I hope this helped you if you are thinking about going rush, going through Rush and everything. Also comment down below if you are going to be a freshman, not this upcoming year, but like next year and you're thinking about Rush. And leave some questions if you have any questions and I'll definitely be sure to answer them in like a more full, like a more in-depth video about Rush specifically. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys later. Bye.